Hi everyone, it's Lucinda and Trish from The Bees Knees and um, we're coming to you late on a Saturday afternoon. We've been busy getting organised, um, adding product, uh, lots coming in. Lots coming in and the things we want to show today are a couple of new um, brands of tea towel and other sort of tableware. Just a quick one, like Just we always say. <laughs> <laughs> and then we uh, yak on. Of course um, we do. So One come, quick thing, one. so the chalk on chocks that we got just before um, Valentine's, this one sold out so quickly. We have them back in stock with the teapot, the cupcake and the, um, the little cup and saucer. These are handmade dark and white Belgian chocolate. They're made in England. Um, so if you missed out, um, we have plenty back in stock now. Yeah, and we have some new chocolate and chocolate products coming and some we're Easter. Add, yeah, there's some on there already. We're adding more. We're adding more. They're yeah, coming. So they're what, very cute. Watch this space. And delicious. <laughs> yeah. Delicious. So um, well, first we'll start off with Corinne Alexander, who we've had before. We've had her tea towels before. We loved them. Um, when we first got them, they sold out. We ordered again. We've ordered several times. I, I'll flip the sleeve off because um, these tea towels are stunning and bright and colourful and cheerful. And we always say, if you've got something like this, you know, you've got to love it. And yeah. these are great. So she does this carrot. And healthy. Yeah, she does it. The carrots. <laughs> <laughs> she does a bright green broccoli, she does a bright red tomato. Look on the website, there are quite a few different vegetables and fruits that are designed like this and they're fabulous. Um, we do have them here. I think. Oh, yes. oh there we go. The broccoli. broccoli. Look, how, look at those colours, if you have that in and, your kitchen. And the radishes and, and the, the tomatoes tomato. and the cherries under there. I, yeah, I love them. Oh, and black the blackberries. Blackberries. Okay. So we've added um, a couple of new ones. And this one, and aprons. So the aprons are brand new. They're brand new to Corinne Ooh. Alexander too. So Hang on. The... Wait a minute. Hot stuff. Uh, sorry, no, hot sauce. <laughs> hot sauce. Um, <laughs> bake. Bake. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. She said she wanted to be the hot stuff. We said, okay, true. Uh, uh, this, I love this. Uh, that way. That way. Yeah. So this goes with the oh, apron. The KitchenAid mix. Oh, it doesn't say KitchenAid. KitchenAid, no. It looks like a KitchenAid mix though. Cake, yeah. tin, eggs, lovely. Yeah. The colours, I, we just love her use of colours. The lovely blue there. Oh yeah, half uh, a dozen eggs. eggs. Yep. That's really cute, isn't it? Yeah. So they're brand new. The, the hot stuff. Hot stuff. Oh, we've had that in a tea towel, haven't we? Opened. We've restocked the tea towels. The um, hot stuff tea towels. And we also got um, this one, which we actually have the placemats. Oh, is there a question, Chris? Bring them on camera. Bring me? Who? Which one? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just getting out my. This is my matching tea towel. That's it. It's hot tea this towel. This is great for barbecuing, though, yeah, isn't it? Really? Oh, fabulous yeah. for the summer. Yeah, it, and actually, if the men's, it, and they are men's. all made in England, by the way, 100% cotton made in England. That's the cutlery drawer one. Kind of unique, I think. And we've got the tea towel that goes with that. Um, <clears throat> another new apron. Yeah. And then the other new apron is the gin. So we had this in the tea towel, and we had it in the coaster, didn't we? And it was so um, popular. It sold out really quick. But look at that. Can you see them? Um, did we get the craft beer apron? I'm uh, yeah, we did, I think. Yes, we did. Um, and it's not here. Not here. We do so have there's it. an apron. They're all under Corinne Alexander on the website. Fabulous. Um, and also we've added, um, so there's the. we also have the coasters radish coasters which go with the radish tea towel and we have the table mat in radish as well we've got some of those yes there. we yeah. do and the blackberry so they're her coat her table Sorry. mats her table mats they're heavy they're heavier than the normal ones which are like a card a heavy a thick card with a, like a melamine this is real melamine look how thick they are they're very heavy weight and that's the uk table mat size very hard wearing. Yeah, and they're, they're made in England. And made in England. And made, everything's made in England. The blackberry. I love, love the blackberry range. The other new tea towel and coasters are. Oh, let me get that out. The Bordeaux Reds. Uh -huh. And it was, was it official wine drinking day? It was wine, um, National Drink Wine Day yesterday. So oh, we did. I did have a glass of wine. So all the drink coasters, we have the beer ones as well. If you line them all up, they are one long picture. Does so it work? Cool. Yes, it does. So oh, the end. Maybe it goes oh, on the other end. end. There we yep, go. Perfect. Was there a question, Chris? No. And then we have the tea towel there. Do we have that in apron? No. No. Okay. Oh, oh, hold the tea towel up again, Trish. Oh, yeah. It's Bordeaux reds with the matching coasters. Okay. So these are, as I said, all under Corinne Alexander. Um, very popular, the mackerel. They've just, since we introduced them last year, they've been bestsellers they really have 
Okay. Um, so that's those. So the store covered the chair. That's Corinne Alexander, and that brings us to talk about tea towels because we have another new designer here, Stuart Gardner, who has some great um, informative tea towels. I'm going to show you. Now the Corinne Alexander is a thick canvasy cotton, very thick, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And there's a place in the kitchen for every type of tea towel in its personal preference as well. Stuart Gardner's tea towels, and on the band, each band, it shows you um, what the tea towel has got on it when it's held out, but I'm going to hold it out to you. This one is his sourdough bread. Hands up those who mastered sourdough during the lockdown. Me. It's you. And I, I mastered eating your sourdough. <laughs> <laughs> I did as well. Now this, this particular one is very involved, and it does take you through what you have to do to make the starter, make the dough, the shaping, the baking. It's everything What's to do. What's on the towel with the mayonnaise? With the mayonnaise. Oh, this oh. one. That is the store cupboard tea towel. Um, so there's the store cupboard and the British store cupboard that you can see online. So it has all the favourite store cupboard items. Oh, Pretty Branston cool. Pickle. Branston Pickle. Branston Pickle HP yep. sauce. Lovely. Somebody came in and bought some HP sauce today. <laughs> that's good. So that so this tea towel, and that that's a thick tea towel. This is a thinner, finer cotton thinner it's going to dry very readily yeah uh, it's going to get wet quicker but it's going to dry quicker when you hang it up anyway so it's personal preference and again these are also made in england the finer weave bit better for drying glassware glass and things like that yeah. so yeah there's a place for it all so that's the sourdough and i'm not going to get every single one out but we have the wine tea towel it's oh, well you are going to get it <laughs> of course i'm going to get them all out i mean why, why wouldn't i <laughs> There we go, wines, tells you the history of wine, all about different wines. Um, Even how to clink your wine on National Drink Wine Day. <laughs> and great <laughs> gifts for wine lovers. Yeah, great gifts. And you know, everyone knows a wine lover, don't they? Um, I think so. This one, a guide, so there's several of these guides. A guide to pairing spices with food. A guide to pairing white wine and a guide to pairing red wine. I think there's another one as well. I think there might be a beer one. So somewhere. these are like the horizontal. And it's a chart. Now I read up there are 1,600 1, different combinations of pairing. So you never make that wine pairing or spice pairing faux pas that you all fear at a dinner party. <laughs> But um, so these would be tea yeah. towels to study before you use them. Before you use them. <laughs> um, I think this one was the one it said that there was like you know one thousand six hundred pairings on there. Never make a mistake again. So there we go. <laughs> and what foods go with it and everything. It's quite quite a work of art, isn't it? So There's a guide to fizz. The coffee. Hold them up. Guide to fizz. I'm gonna get that one out because it's a slightly different. It's got actually a nice sort of shaped picture. But we're not getting them all out. Well, you know, one or two, <laughs> just one or two. There we go. Oh, I love this that is, one. This is the champagne one. Um, yeah, it's great. Oh, I hadn't seen that. I yeah, it's not thing. a chart. It's actually more sort of picturey. It's lovely. Well, we are getting them all out, I guess. Yeah. If people are liking it, um, the coffee one. This is really cool for the coffee drinkers, which would go with our this with the coffee uh, print. Great oh, gift. Yeah, Oops. For the coffee drinkers. And then this one. Oh, I know someone I could get this for. Whiskey. It's a whiskey bottle, and inside the whiskey bottle is uh, all the information about whiskeys and bourbons. 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 Sorry, I'm... Bourbons are the biscuits. Bourbons are the biscuits. I but get muddled up because we don't say bourbon. We say bourbon. And the gin one is very similar. It comes in like a gin bottle there. You know, the pictures has all the information inside a cute gin bottle. And then last but not least, the beer tea towel. Not last. I have another one. Oh, yeah. All right, we'll do that one. Oh, let's just get that The beer tea towel. There we go. All about brewing beer, how it's made, how, how all different types. Which glass for which, which beer. Glass. Oh, yeah. Which glass you put in. So everything you can think of, basically. And then last but not least, the, not, last but not least, the Bee Friendly in Your Garden. This is 100% organic cotton um, with all bees and flowers and everything. It's all the flowers that help bees, isn't it? It's a very <laughs> environmental... Friendly and the times of year that they're out so yeah. so how to encourage bees in your garden what to grow there's a question do yeah. you have any for the queen jubilee we are getting some in we have a few of the allison gardeners left yes um few allison gardener left not many but we're restocking we're restocking those we are getting victoria, victoria eggs. eggs should be with us they are actually already available to pre-order on the website um um, Victoria eggs and Alison Gardner tea towels. That's, that's the only it. two we're getting. Oh. But from um, 
from Victoria Eggs were getting mugs, teacups and saucers, pillows, tea towels, aprons. Fabulous, beautiful Bobbles, design. Yeah. Baubles that match the design she did last year for the Queen's 95th birthday. And the design is based on, I think, the Queen's coronation dress and all the embroideries that were on it. it really special. And we are getting more Alison Gardner mugs and tea towels in. And we're getting more Danoon mugs in, but they won't be here till April. But if you want your name putting on the list, um, just email us at info at the bees British Imports com and let us know because everybody is wanting them. So, oh, no, McClagan. and then we're getting McClagan Smith. Um, we're getting some McClagan Smith ones in too. So different price ranges. No, different... the McClagan one, it's got one of them actually has the official Jubilee emblem on it, which is a purple. It's designed by some design student in England. It's a purple sort of squiggly uh, crown emblem with the, the writing around yeah. it, it's quite nice. So we're getting one of those. So they're ordered, they shouldn't be too long. Emma, um, Victoria Eggs should hopefully be shipping next week, mm. Danoon in March, Alison Gardner probably in March. Um, we also, if you look under Jan Constantine, we have some gorgeous pillows coming. The Emma Bridgewater Jubilee mugs. Yes, thank you for that question. We are getting more of those and they should be with us the week after next. And we are not getting limited numbers. Limited numbers. All of this is, is limited edition. Um, so if you want one, please let us know and we'll put you on the list. And we are also getting tins next week. Probably they have shipped. Um, the God Save the, the God Queen. Save the Queen Jubilee tins. Um, and what we're getting is what we're getting. We've been told they are sold out and we won't be able to restock. So on the website, they're not on the website yet. They will be um, probably by the end of next week, beginning of the week after when we get them. And obviously we'll do a live and a newsletter and you'll be able to know to order those right away. But that is definitely going to be a, if you want it, get it. Because I was told by the people in England that we won't be able to reorder those. Yep. No umming and ahhing or dithering or whatever. Faffing. Faffing about. Don't do it. Um, just get, get them. them. <laughs> Same with these Easter eggs. We've sold a lot of them. We are getting more in, hopefully. But that'll <laughs> but be they, it. <laughs> they've been selling like crazy too. Yeah. Um, I'm just to go back to the Jan Constantine pillows. Um, if you know them, they're gorgeous hand embroideries high quality felt pillows and they are going to be one of the more expensive items on the website but they're going to be stunning for the jubilee for the queen yeah. so they are already there um i need to just add that they're for pre-order um but they should be with us in a couple of weeks too is that the ebt tins T. no these are the egg tins oh the um the jubilee tin do they mean Put put a put a message in the comments and we will get back to that um after the video because we are getting the tea caddy the jubilee tea caddy the red one with the dome front if that's the one you mean yes we are getting we're getting quite a few of those so yeah. that should be good the tray and a rectangular tin yes are the three ones we're getting mm -hmm. and the um the tin trays so that's what yeah that's the jubilee stuff we're getting who's putting all these away oh I've got to go sorry <laughs> <laughs> I think we've both got to go haven't we? <laughs> That thank, brings us to thank, going. Thank you to Chris for being a photographer today, for being the camera lady today. Was there another question, Chris? No. Well, thank you for watching. Put comments in here or messages at info at the Um And we'll get to them. And I'm sure we'll be back next week with something else. Um, so thank you for watching and we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.